Hi guys, it's Marlo, and I'm here at my bands, and I'm going to do a little chest workout, build up our pectorals. So let's get started. It's a couple simple exercises. What I want you to do is just put your left foot down, keep your bands evenly, and this is called the cable crossover. What we're going to do is just bring our hands up and cross them. One. And notice how I'm keeping my palms out a little. If they're not low, I'm trying to keep them high. I'd say like above your navel. And breathing each one, it might seem easy at first. And if you have trouble standing on one foot, just put your feet together. That really doesn't matter. It's your choice. And you're going to do this for about 8 to 10 reps. If you don't know what reps are, of course, that's 8 to 10 times. I'm feeling it already. Bring it up, hold one second. Bring it up, hold one second. Down. Now, if you need to rest, rest for about 15 to 30 seconds, even a minute. So, I'm going to go right into the next exercise because I don't have to. We're going to do another, it's called the cable crossover, but how we're not going to cross over, we're just going to bring palms together. Our last set was crossing, however, we're just going to bring it right up, squeeze, down. This one's easy, but it works, too. If you want a nice chest, this is the way to do it. It'll give you actually a nice form, a good foundation. Actually, it's working already. I can feel it. Now, one more. Squeeze. Down. And now, again, you could rest, but I'm going to go right into the next exercise. I'm going to turn it to the side. Put your feet together. And some people need a whole minute to rest, and that's fine as long as you continue it. What I like to do is go from one exercise to another, like an obstacle course, because you'll burn fat and build some muscle. So right now we're just going to do a basic press, incline press for the chest. Two, three, and don't lock your arms out like this. Just go right to about 80% down. These are hard, trust me. Hold down. Bring it up, squeeze, down. Now, what we're going to do is just, that was an incline press. What we're going to do is just a regular press, like a bench press, more or less. Begin. Keep your hands high, but not high, high, medium high, right through about here. And if this, this is difficult, go lower. Bring it out, squeeze. 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 And again, you do this about six to eight reps. Okay. See, I could feel it already. I feel it in my chest, but I also feel it in my shoulders and my triceps. And actually, that's really good because you get to work everything. But mostly, it's embracing the muscle you're trying to form. Stretching now. Always stretch. We just did a few sets in a row. Go to the wall, or you can hold on to the side of the wall. What you're going to do is put your hand against the wall, cross your leg, and just breathe in. Breathe out and just relax. Hold for 15 seconds, up to 25 seconds. And I want you to feel through here, relaxing. Think like you're in a park or something. Now, I want you to switch to the other side. Put your hand out, cross your leg, and just relax. Close your eyes. You can actually go into the park and do this. If you live by Central Park, go to Central Park. If you're in Washington, go to the Washington State Park. Or just do it right in your kitchen like me. So that was two quick stretches. See, you're building your muscle, but you also got to stretch it as well. So after you do the two stretches, you could repeat this again. And I would repeat this about three to four times. So let's begin again. Ready? Right together. Or you can put the feet together. It's up to you. And it doesn't seem like much because you're like home doing it, but it really works. It's affordable, effective. Why not do it? Squeeze. And now I'm going to go right into the crossover. And remember, we're working the chest, but a lot of other muscles are involved. I can feel it in my abdominals because I'm flexing them, I'm squeezing them. Okay, now you remember it up. The press, straight out, back, straight out, 
And notice how I'm bringing my palms here. I'm not going, I'm keeping total control. When you lose your control, take a rest. I'm going to go up two more. Two, one. Now right into the incline. I can actually really feel it. This works your chest and your shoulders. And if you want to get real advanced, put your palms this way. That'll work your lower pectoral. See, your chest, there's a lot of muscles involved. There's the lower, the upper. A lot of men, they get the old sag, they call it. The lower gets weak. That's why with chest, it's not about benching. It's about hitting all different aspects of the muscle. That's why I'm here to help you. Now, I need a stretch. I'm going to stretch again. Tell you what. All you need is a few sets, two to three times of this obstacle course, you'll be on your way. Stretch again, cross the leg, chin down, breathe. 15, 25 seconds, switch. You can do this on your lunch break. Relaxation. Loosen up your hands a little bit. Should be really happy because you got your blood going. You just got a little healthier and a little wiser. Thank you for joining me. I'll see you next time.